Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Julie and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2 where we're going to do a little gift guide for the girl that has everything, aka me, so kind of my Christmas wish list plus some other things that I think you can get for the girl that has everything because... I am an impulsive buyer. I buy things when I want things. It's a bad habit. And now that I do social media, I get so many things in PR, which I'm so incredibly grateful for. But I pretty much get what I want and what I need. So it's easy but hard at the same time to shop for me. So I definitely understand. I'll have everything linked in the description box for you guys to purchase. And any family watching this, um, I think some of the things have already been purchased for me, so I'll definitely write it in the description if you guys want to use this as a guide for me. But other than that, make sure to subscribe and let's get on into the video. I have my little list on my phone. I don't have a crazy amount of things, so it's the girl who has everything, you know what I mean? Okay, first up is these Victoria's Secret pajamas. I already have them in brown and I love them. They are so soft, so comfortable, and they look like sexy just because they're like a little bit low cut, show a little bit of the booty, but not too much, you know what I'm saying? Like it's just super cute um, and again, super comfy. And I like that it's long sleeves and shorts because I live in Florida, so sometimes I get cold, but then if I'm wearing something too warm then I get hot so honestly any kind of like a little pajama set I really want the skims set as well just a regular like long sleeve long pants one I think that restocking products is such a good gift for example I love the Fawn Beauty skincare set so that could be like a good gift just because when people um you know run out of things it's annoying to go rebuy it so when somebody else buys it for you it's kind of nice or you can restock somebody on their favorite toner, moisturizer, eye cream, anything like that I feel like is super nice. Okay, so there are a couple of things that I really want, but I think my mom or my dad already got this for me. But the On Cloud sneakers, I want them in the all white. I have so many workout sneakers from like eight years ago. They're wearing down. I have extremely flat feet, so I need like a nice pair of workout sneakers. I kind of want to trash the rest because they are just not doing it for me, not giving me enough support. So I feel like an all white pair will really match with pretty much all of my workout outfits. So a nice pair of workout shoes for somebody I feel like is also perfect. Also Converse. Converse have been super in, especially like the platform ones. Those are so cute. I really, really love the vibe of those i wouldn't mind getting a few and i feel like they're super trendy and i feel like they've been trendy forever like when i was younger i used to have like a pink and a purple pair of converse and i love that they're kind of like making their way back i do want the huda beauty powders and i know i've kind of talked shit about them before i think they're good products they just break me out i just have sensitive skin but i would like them for my kit Specifically the shade Cupcake I definitely want in my professional makeup kit. Um, just because I really want that like blurred under eye and face for my clients. It would be ideal to get like every single shade. But you know like one or two shades. If you guys don't have sensitive skin and you want like a flawless powder. That one is really good. I have a bunch of Amazon tops and little two piece sets that I'm super into. I'm kind of trying to build like a better capsule wardrobe and I feel like I've been doing a really good job at it. So I feel like some of these tops would be perfect to add to my collection. As I'm getting some in, I'm letting some go. I feel like when you have a lot of good basics that are like low back, long sleeve, bodysuit, all the things, you could put together so many more outfits. So maybe you can build somebody a capsule wardrobe. I feel like that's super helpful. I've been into the pointed heel look and I already know that my sister bought me these for my birthday but I'm super excited for these. They're just like these short little heels that are pointed, shiny, and they strap in the back so they're not going to fall off but I feel like it is such a classy heel. I really like wearing like little heels when I go out now. I used to be just like a sandal girl 
but I really just kind of like elevated that so I feel like I could wear it with like jeans or a dress it's very versatile like kind of make it like more like a casual chic outfit or a dressy outfit so a little pointed heel is a nice closet staple again kind of like a capsule wardrobe item there's two luxury items that I really 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 well honestly three but one of them I'm, I want to buy for myself I want these Gucci shoes I think my boyfriend is gonna get them for me they're just sandals so I've had my Tory Burch sandals for the longest time literally since eighth grade and I'm turning 23 so that's I don't even know how many years it's time for a new pair I want to upgrade them a little bit and they are so cute I just need a new pair of sandals again I need to toss those so again updating my capsule wardrobe so I feel like the idea here is capsule wardrobe and then these Prada sneakers they are so freaking cute I need like a black pair of sneakers but like nice pair that I could wear out but make my outfits more casual. Sometimes I just don't want to wear like my Nike Air Forces, you know what I mean? I just want like a step up above that, like still make it chic, you know what I'm trying to say? Not like sporty. Um, and then I could show you guys the item also that I'm thinking of buying once I hit 100k on TikTok, which is like these white Louis Vuitton sneakers so cute i need like again a level up of like the little sneakers that i have now just so that if i don't want to wear heels but i don't want to wear sandals it's kind of like an in-between i will use the heck out of them i've really been into sneakers lately i just put this one together but a filtered shower head i feel like i've been wanting that for the longest time and i just thought about it and i was like oh my god that would be perfect but i wouldn't probably ask for that just because my boyfriend's a plumber and I'm sure he knows which one is like the best to get so I'll let him handle that but I feel like that would be a really good gift for somebody that has everything because I feel like most people don't have that and it's supposed to help your hair and your skin so I also have been really wanting to try the Colleen Rothschild eye cream the tinted one that kind of just like blurs and adds a little bit of sheerness to your under eyes it looks so pretty makes you look so awake i have hereditary dark circles so it's kind of you know when i don't want to wear makeup i feel like it makes me look a little bit ghostly because they're so dark so i feel like that would be really good but it's been sold out for so long i hope it comes back in stock soon there are a few things that i want for my business so if anybody has a business maybe they're starting something up that's new I feel like that's also something really nice so that they don't have all these extra expenses I just spent so much money on this brow course but I need some products for my ombre powder brow business so I asked my mom for this stand-up chair but I think I'm gonna ask for like a big ring light and I also need one of those rolly cart things um, those are just like some things that I need for my business so I feel like you know if the person that has everything has a little business or something that they're trying to get into like a little side hustle they want to create like an Etsy business you can get them a Cricut stuff like that I love me some jewelry and Amazon has really cute earrings specifically these ones I so would love these um, but like any hoops things like that Amazon has such good jewelry and last but not least home items pillows duvets all the things I think they are such good gifts I'm moving out next year personally so that would be a good gift as well I feel like having you know the like choppable pillows oh my god I want those for my bed I want like that big fluffy bed whenever I get my place I don't know when I'm moving out or what but when I do I want like a big fluffy bed home decor if you're good at picking that stuff out always a good gift alrighty guys and this is my holiday gift guide for myself or for the person that has everything let me know what you guys think and I'm definitely doing some more holiday gift guides coming up in the next few days we have under $25 for men and women we have under a hundred dollars gift guide for the makeup lover but you don't know their specific shade that's another video definitely comment what you guys want to see but yeah i love you guys and i'll see you guys in the next one but make sure to subscribe because we're uploading every single day in december well till christmas okay i love you guys bye